James got home like this. Where is he? Remember, because the COVID shuffle, we're doing shifts and we're like virtually together right now, but not, you know, because James, you did four to seven. That's our new thing for COVID. I'm doing seven to 10, but I'm pulling every time you get out, I pull you back in. I pull you back in because it's 20. <laughs> Just when I think I've gotten yeah. away. You pull me back in. See, he Good morning, yeah, James. I will. Will you do? Listen, people are wondering why you're back in, and I'll tell them in a second. But will you do? Will you do? Will you do your Owen Wilson for me? Wow! Wow! <laughs> See what I mean? James is a real entertainer, you guys. And the thing you might not know is today we celebrate 20 years of Jamesy at Cron 4 in many different capacities. Though James, you didn't Over just show years. up as an anchor. No. Yeah. First started uh, 20 years ago just as a freelance writer, a couple days a week, uh -huh. and then eventually became a producer on the morning show. Worked with you behind the scenes for many years right. before ultimately jumping onto this side right. of the camera. Oh my God, it seems I like know. just yesterday. You're really that old? <laughs> Let's take a look at little baby James, and this was something that his family put together. We interrupt your regular broadcasting with some breaking news. I'm Jack Fletcher. And I'm Colin Fletcher. And our dad, James Fletcher. This guy right here has been working for Cron for 20 years today. So with the help of our mom, Karen, we've put together a short video to show our dad just how much his coworkers and the community appreciate him. That's right, roll the tape. Well, the time is now 6.35, time to get our check on road conditions again, and they'll do that through television or radio announcements. It's at that point you can buy one at your local grocery store. I mean, they've got a great variety, but why not? Go someplace that's got lots of pumpkins. I mean, lots of pumpkins. Jamesy, this is where we have so many heart-to-heart -heart talks. The truth is, you're an amazing friend, and I told Karen I wasn't going to do this with makeup because I don't want to cry. Um, 20 years. I remember when you first showed glimpses of wanting to be on the air. Really? You're in my ear, and you're coming in from a bump shot as a producer telling me, hey, the Bay Bridge is sparkling clear, the sun rising. And I'm like, okay, thank you. You're either a pilot or you're just giving me what I want to say, like, with your radio voice. Um, and then you made your face so it wasn't a face for radio, and you look pretty good on TV. You have changed my life for the better, and I would not want to be here without you, so don't ever leave that seat. James, I can't believe it's been 20 years for you at Cron. I know during that time you have been such a positive force for so many people coming through Cron, and I can only speak for myself, but every day that I come in with that smile on your face and the energy that you share with us, and of course how serious you take your job and uh, sharing the most important information with our viewers, it is so refreshing and so inspiring. Congratulations on your 20 years at Cron, James. It's amazing to get to uh, be with you there every day day just as it is for all of us that get to work with you can't say enough how much we appreciate you mr fletcher tis the ghost of newscast past i had an amazing privilege of working with you for 16 years you're one of the greatest anchors producers weather casters i've ever worked with and i know dozens of other people who would say the exact same thing about you you're a man who can do it all and do it well it's your smarts your work ethic your compassion, your willingness to always help others, and along with your dashing good looks, that makes us all lucky to know you. And congratulations, James Fletcher, for 20 years on Cron 4. James, I just want to wish you a happy 20th anniversary. We are so fortunate to have you on our air, but I will say I feel fortunate that I get to work alongside you and be given the opportunity to get to know you and your wonderful family. Happy 20th. I'm fortunate to count you among my coworkers and friends here at Cron. Oh my God, I'm so sweet. No, what is it? It's like you died. When I saw this, I, I was know. like, I were retired, which is just, I was like, James, what, are you going somewhere? Nope, staying right here probably for another 20. Phew. But man, I was shocked when I saw, for those of you who don't know, that was Mark Dannon, whose shoes I filled when he moved on to right. bigger and better things. Right. Living his best life. Right. Uh, but yeah, it's been a wild ride. A wild ride to be sure. And I had no idea that Karen and the kids had put that together. I asked Karen, I said, the kids recorded 
themselves here yeah. in my office. When did they do that without me knowing? And she said, you go to bed at five. They had time. <laughs> yeah, right. <laughs> yeah, we're right. all up. Yeah, living right. life, living life. Oh, my <laughs> gosh. The, the kids were adorable, and, and I include you in that, too. You were just adorable. Oh, my God. Like, what a baby face. I can't, that yeah. old video. What, that was, that was way before you came to Kron. That was way before I came to Kron. Yeah. yeah, Karen went back into the archives to find an old, uh -huh. an old VHS tape and had it uh, digitally transferred over so that she could work that in. It was amazing. I gave her a big hug when I came home. I said, you, 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 it takes a lot to surprise me, but you did I, it. You I was kind of surprised, too. I was like, you're kind of a good-looking guy. I mean, I'll, I'll never say it to your face. Um, a, a, but a much slimmer, a much slimmer James. I'll never admit this. I'll never admit this. James, <laughs> I miss you so much, though. I mean, I know, like, you know, the whole COVID thing is really hard. I need, I need some help yeah. with science and math and your perspective on life. And I'm not kidding. We, you guys don't know this, the viewers. We solve the world's problems during two-minute commercials. And that's because of James. Yep. You've Usually invented, between 5 and 6 a.m. You invented fire, the wheel. I mean, it all happens. <laughs> and I just miss And we it. have so many more things to solve in the years to come. We do. I have to say, I, I love working with you. I love working with John and Raina. Will, Sarah, it's Camila so right. out in the field. Yeah. All the producers upstairs. Yeah. And all the people past and present to this entire station. I tell everybody every time they always yeah. ask me, you know, why do you keep staying? Because, you know, in this business, you renew contracts over and over and over. And, right. you know, every couple of years, you don't know if you yeah. have a job or if you want to stay. I've always wanted to stay because the people here are the best. Yeah. I agree. Best. I agree. It's what kept, it's so. what kept me here for, you know, the, the, the five years I've been here, too. All right. <laughs> <laughs> you're, you're, yeah, Daria predates me. You, you, we won't ask Daria how long she's been you'll here, but we're going to have a big party. You'll always be at 23 years. All right. <laughs> I'll see you uh, Monday morning. Okay. Bye-bye. <laughs> Bye. We'll be right back.